Yeah. So, so how would you describe yourself at the moment? Realistically, I help people by providing evidence-based tools for them to think about and adjust their narrative. I help them learn practices to build self-awareness and mastery. And I, I give them this confidence to step forward in their career. I give them the benefit of, of what it is that these things can have. This trusted relationship where you can both learn evidence-based tools as well as explore your own world, your own self-awareness, your own journey towards mastery, and hopefully that confidence to, to go forward. Those are the things that, that I'm passionate about. My demographics largely senior executives in the public service and sometimes in ministerial offices and now it's expanding into the health professions but if you look there's a similarity which is this highly pressurized environment so that's that's i think what i do and what i'm really interested in now is how do i help people it sounds like you want to be impactful and you you want to be someone who really helps not just move the people you work with, but more broadly, as part of a larger goal of contribution, of legacy. The, the way I see is the upstream part is if I can work with leaders to help them enact whatever it is that they're leading in better, that that makes the change, that that's then creates the legacy that, that my dad always told me I needed to think about was what legacy are you leaving? How are you making the world better? There's so much psychology behind leadership and leadership development and how you employ leadership in a variety of different contexts. You're dealing with a human psyche and their narrative. This is the words they use to describe their world has created their reality. How do we help them rewrite the context? I think that's probably a mark of successful people in that they can modulate. There's yeah. that ability to modulate, right? I think um, probably one of the secrets to a happy life is to, yeah. to recognize context, for yeah. people to grow, you know, they need they need honest, you know, honest feedback. There needs yeah. to be the level of trust, which comes from having a trusted counselor, a trusted coach, a trusted colleague who you can trust to give you the real deal. If the intention is there, it's an intention to help you get somewhere better, and that's a mm. positive intention, then yeah. that makes all the difference. Someone can be really quite brutal and you can laugh at the end of it, take it on board. For a creator, it can be a bit of a curiosity game. We're watching a documentary on tax code tonight, and you will like it. <laughs> <laughs>